All right, week number 10 at Grapevine CrossFit. Here's our programming overview for the week. It is the week of open 24.2. So Friday and Saturday will be spent occupied doing that. But the rest of the days, they're all up for grabs. All right, so on Monday, we're gonna do some handstand practice. Okay, so I assume at some point during the open, we'll be going upside down, whether it's a wall walk, a handstand push up, or a handstand walk. So to prepare for that, we are going to just spend 10 minutes practicing, whether it's kicking up onto a wall, doing a wall walk, trying to do a wall walk with our arms straight, or maybe we're practicing a handstand walk in pirouettes. All right, depending on skill level, this is what we'll be doing for at least 10 minutes. If you don't know what drills to practice, that's why the coaches are there. So ask and they'll give you something to work on. All right, our Metcon for the day. We're gonna row, do dumbbell strict press, we're going to lunge. It's going to be a chipper style. So we'll row 500, dumbbell strict press. We're going to do 25 of them. Then we're going to lunge 250 feet. You're going to have one dumbbell when you do that. We'll row again, lunge again, strict press again, row again. I'm going to test this one tomorrow. I'll let you guys know how it goes. If it goes too long, we'll throw a time cap on there and uh, you'll be fine. Don't worry about it. It's a longer one, but it's nothing crazy. Nothing we can't do. We're going to take it a little bit easy. We're still recovering from the open that we hit on Friday and Saturday. Tuesday. If you've ever done squat therapy before, you're going to on Tuesday. Not everyone's squat is perfect. We have some great squatters in the gym, some people who struggle with depth, some people who struggle with collapsing midline. That's what squat therapy focuses on. All right, keeping that upright torso and opening the hips as we squat down. So there's a video in Sugar Wad telling you what this is and how to practice it. And we're gonna walk it through uh, as coaches. We're gonna work with each athlete, figuring out how well you can do this, and where to practice, and what to focus on as you do it. All along that line, we'll be doing front squat afterwards, three by two. So kind of getting a little bit heavier this week, trying to peak a little bit for the open. Following that, we'll have a short little AMRAP, only eight minutes long. We'll do eight V-ups, eight strict pull-ups, and then eight hip extensions off the GHD. This is a solid workout, I did it last week. You guys will like it. Just a, almost like a little pump for your core. Then on Wednesday, we're gonna squat snatch. We're gonna do a set of five, two sets of three, um, two, and then one. So work up to a heavy here as well, but the emphasis is on our squat part of the snatch. We've been doing a lot of snatch balances. We've been doing overhead squats. We've been working towards this movement for quite a long time. So let's nail our movement off the floor and let's nail our movement in the receiving position. You guys have this movement now way better than you did before. So let's take advantage of it. Let's encourage one another in it and uh, let's have a good time seeing what our squat snatch can be. Then we'll have a quick uh, Metcon again. Tested this one. You guys will probably uh, like it that it's a good training Metcon, but dislike it because it hurts just a little bit. We're gonna do five shuttle runs. It's gonna be 50 feet, so down and back is one. Then you'll do five clusters. If you've never done a cluster, it's a little bit worse version of a thruster because you have to squat clean it every time. It's gonna be at 135 and 95. Then you'll finish by doing another five shuttle runs. Good news for you is that you get 90 seconds of rest each set. These should and probably will take somewhere between one and a half to two and a half minutes for most of us. On Thursday, we'll hit a recovery, uh, Imam, we'll go every two minutes, we'll have some Turkish get-ups, some assault bike, and some reverse sled drag, just to get the heart rate up, the blood pumping, and uh, heal some of our muscles from the week. And prepare us for Friday, Friday Night Lights, 24.2, going down once again. We'll see who's in the lead after this week, and uh, we'll see if Team Nate needs to pick it up at all, or if we're just going to run, run away with it, like I assume we will. But... Uh, should be a great week, fun week, good mix of everything. Expectant for um, Friday's open workout. If you stayed this long in the video, here's my prediction. I think it will be shuttle runs and thrusters or shuttle runs and wall walks, but I think there will be shuttle runs. All right, have a great week and I'll see you in the gym.